Francis Dunlap Gamewell of Camden, South Carolina lived a storied life, including serving as a missionary in China and being one of the famous fighting parsons during the Siege of the Legations during the Boxer Rebellion in 1900. Francis Gamewell was born in Camden in 1857. The outbreak of the U.S. Civil War led his family to relocate up north. In 1881, he joined the American Methodist Episcopal Mission and was assigned to Beijing, China, called Peking at the time. He was a missionary and the principal of a boys' school. He would spend the next few decades serving at different posts. Then, in early 1900, an anti-foreign, anti-Christian peasant movement spread across China, burning churches and killing Chinese Christians. The Boxers, as the participants were called, also targeted Gamewell and the other missionaries in Peking. On June 19th, the already ominous situation in Beijing took a turn for the worse, when the Chinese government ordered all foreigners to leave the city within 24 hours. Fearing they'd be massacred if they left the legation, the foreigners decided to defy the order. The British minister, Claude Maxwell MacDonald, appointed Gamewell as the head of a committee for fortifications and gave him absolute authority to organize the fortifications of the British legation against an anticipated attack. Gamewell undertook the assignment as if he was on a mission from God. He and the members of his team, nicknamed the Fighting Parsons, spent their days filling sandbags, building barricades, strengthening walls, and making gun slits for firing through. He designed bomb shelters and even dug trenches and moats as part of the defenses. When the Chinese attack did come on June 22nd and continued for 55 days, Gamewell's powerful barricades held. Not a single civilian was killed in the British legation, and the siege became less of a battle and more of a stalemate with only sporadic Chinese attacks. Gamewell was still strengthening his fortifications when an Allied expeditionary force raised the siege and rescued the foreigners within the legation on August 14, 1900. Following the siege, he and his wife returned to the U.S., but the desire to serve in China was great, and he once again returned in 1909. He served for 27 more years as a missionary in that country before retiring in the United States. Francis Dunlap Gamewell, the fighting parson, passed away in 1950. And now we know. And knowing is half the battle.